All right, my math, growth, mindset, bam, brain cells, pathways, firing, developing like highways, high super speedways, high super speed highways through those phases. <laughs> Speaking of speed, today we're going to be learning about average speed. And then we're going to throw a little bit all other kinds of speed to distinguish it from average speed. Let's go. Maniac Panthers. Math side, there is a speed. 40 miles per hour. You're like, well, oh, there's that per again, but that's a different per. See, the per for a kitty goes P U R R, or is it just P U R? Uh, anyway, so prrr, like the prrr, roll your R's on that one. We're talking about P E R, which when you write it down, it's really like this 40 per 40 hour. I forgot the miles in there. 40 miles per hour. So where's the other number? Uh-huh. So yeah, when I watch this video, you guys might remember this from the uh, Ed puzzle. First other puzzle. Oh, hey, man, I thought you said there's two numbers in a ratio. And this guy's like, yeah, there are. Watch, I'll show you. It's, a, it's hiding. I'll bring it out. Hey, uh, a number that's hiding down there? Can you please show yourself? And all of a sudden it goes, aha, it's per one hour. 40 miles for every one hour. So if it did two hours, there would be 80 miles. If it was three hours, it'd be be 100, 120 miles, right? So anyway, there it is, 40 miles per one hour. So, oh, we got this car over here. Let's bring it back. Okay, so let's say this car goes like this. It goes, by the time he gets to the green here, ready? He goes, he's at 40 miles per hour, but he stays at 40 miles per hour the entire time. And, and to point A to point B. So we'll call this point A call this point B. The entire time from point A to point B, he was at 40 miles per hour and it took him one hour. So from here to here, 40 miles per hour and it took him one hour. Yeah. So in one hour, he traveled 40 miles. That's 40 miles. So we don't need to put the hour here. I mean, if you just say from here to here is 40 miles, he did that in, I'll pick a different color, orange. No, let's pick a uh, green. One hour. So one hour, he did 40 miles, 40 miles per hour. And he stayed that. That's a constant speed. So one of the types of speed are constant. Remember, today's lesson is supposed to be about average speed. So we'll get there in a second. So now let's talk about another kind of speed. And it's before we get to average, we're going to do three kinds. Average will save for last, the best for last, right? What if we have this scenario? Select tool. Not that I don't want to select the road. I don't want to move the road. I want to move the car. There we go. Let's say he's going, and by the time he gets to the green, he's at 40 miles per hour. But then he's like, this car slows him down. He goes, and then he's like going 20 miles per hour. He's not happy with that. He's got a Lamborghini. He wants to really go 80, but he's not on the highway. So, but then, so he passes his car and then he passes it. He's going like 70 miles per hour. Then he slows back down to 50 and then he goes 70. But let's say right when he's at 70, guess what? Oh, oh we got trouble. Guess what? Guess who's over there? Mr. Popo, right here. You didn't see him. Here's the Popo. He's got his little radar gun. And, he, and, and the radar gun goes like this. Right when he's going 70 miles per hour, the radar gun goes. Doo, 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 doo. And the radar gun comes back. Zeke, 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 Zeke. Comes back and tells his, his little machine that he's going 70 miles per hour. And guess what? <laughs> Turns on his lights, flashing lights. Oh, look at the blue. He's red and blue. Woo, woo, woo. When he comes after him, says, "Do you know how fast you're going, sir?" Oh, first he says, "License and registration." Do you know how fast you were going, sir? And then they're like, "Ah, uh, do you know how fast I was going?" And that's not a good idea. I wouldn't do that. I would just be like, "Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I was I passed that guy. I'm guilty." And and then he might feel like, "Oh, you're being honest. I might let you go." But then again, he might not. So because you got a Lamborghini, he might be jealous because he, you know. But anyway, the point is, for that exact moment, it's that instant. At that instant. In that instant, in that one instant, you were going 70 miles per hour. It'd be a shame to get a ticket just for that one moment, right? When most of the other times you're going to speed limit, just that one moment. So that's an instantaneous speed, an instant, instantaneous, aneous. It's not, oh, that sounds funny. Instantaneous speed. So we got a constant speed and instantaneous speed. So, okay, one more. Now we save it, average speed. What's the average speed? So for the average speed, let's say you're going, you're going, and by the time you get to this green thing, you're at 40 miles per hour. Then you slow down a little bit, you speed up past somebody, and then, then you get on the highway, like, 
moving really fast, but by the time you get to point B, remember, you start at point A and you get to point B. Remember, this distance is still 40 miles, right? And it still took you one hour. So it's still 40 miles per hour, but it's not constant. You went up, down, up, down, but overall it took you. So that's the average speed. Let's look at these two speeds here. Which one, these are two average speeds. Which one has the higher average speed? So car A or car B? So you can do a couple of things. The, this first one for car A will do the ratio method. Reduce the ratio method to simplify the ratio. And so we'll say, let's pick red for the top. Use our blue here for our fraction bar. And then we'll do green on the bottom. Oh, not green. Yeah, green on the bottom, red on the top. I didn't do red on the top, did I? So we said 120 divided by 3. So, uh, oh, 120 divided by 3. That's the second way I wanted to show. But since I said it, let's just go ahead and do it. 120 divided by 3. That's how you can find the, it's like a, also called a unit rate because we're putting the one on the bottom, right? Remember our, our speed, our average speed. So three goes into one, does not go into one. Three goes into 12. It sure does go into 12. And that's going to be four times because three times four is 12. Three times four is 12. So put our 12 here, subtract, and there it is, 40. 40 what? 40 miles per one hour now. So 40 miles per, that makes me think of a cat. Every time I'm gonna say that, I'm gonna think of a kitty cat, per one hour, 40 miles per hour. So this car's average speed, we'll call it car A, is 40 miles per hour. Now I'm gonna show you the, the ratio way because the, it's good to be flexible, I'm telling you, to, be, to have multiple ways to solve a problem. And I know you always wanna do the easiest way and whatever is easiest for you, but sometimes that easy way isn't gonna help you solve a different problem. You might need to do a, so-called harder way to solve a different problem. So let's take it the so-called harder way, if you want, if whichever. Maybe that was the harder way, I don't know. But let's look at this other way. This other way is just simplifying it as like a ratio. So let's take 150, that comes from here, the top. And then we're gonna still use fraction bar over five. But we're gonna say, how do we bring it to a, a unit rate like this equals we want the bottom to be a one. So what do we do to a five to turn it into a one? We have to divide it by something. And whatever we do to that bottom, we're gonna to do to the top, divide it by something, that same something, because really we're just dividing this whole thing. We're treating it like it's a, a fraction. And so we're gonna get an equivalent fraction, but really it's in the, we're gonna get the equivalent ratio, like treating it like it's a fraction. So we could say five divided by five is one because one times five is five. So 150 divided by five is, it's the same thing as something times five is 150. I'm gonna do the long division on this. I'm gonna say 150, oh, divided by five. Five goes into 15, three times. So it still gives us 30. So this is 30 miles per one, one, uh-oh, green, one hour. So which one's faster? See, that's car B, right? Car B, we did this kind of light blue thing. 30 miles per hour or 40 miles per hour? Oh, green, buddy, green. Let's not get confused here. And so obviously the A car is faster.